Oh, no. I travel a lot uh, for stand-up, and it's great. I've been, you know, a lot of exotic places. You know, I've gone overseas. I've been to Iraq, been to Germany, been to some dangerous places like, I don't know, the South. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was down in New Orleans, Mississippi, Alabama, Florida. Yeah, it's super aggressively racist down there still. Yeah. Yeah, like, I, that's why it's good to be here in Utah where the racism is subtle and systematic, you know. <laughs> it's like you can almost set your watch to it. 9.15, I hate you too, Dave. <laughs> it's always a guy named Dave, it's cool. But I experienced racism in, 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 in Mississippi in like one of the most unlikely places, Olive Garden. And now you're thinking, what? Oh, geez, what? You experienced that in oh, geez? I was there for bottomless breadsticks, and things happened, okay? It's weird. <laughs> I was hanging out in the lobby with me and my friends. This dude comes in. He kind of just looked like the love child of Elmer Fudd and Yosemite Sam. You know what I mean? <laughs> I'll let your brain do the visual on that. And he comes in and goes, uh-uh. Ain't no brother gonna come up in here and have fettuccine Alfredo. And I was like, first of all, like, why are you being like racist and super meal specific right now? Like, <laughs> what is it about fettuccine Alfredo? Is this like some weird thing that like, is, what is it? White pasta, white sauce, white women. Is it a slippery slope? What is it? I don't understand. <laughs> oh, it's a great time to be alive in America. I love living in this country. I know, like, yes, I probably will talk about race tonight. Don't worry. It happened to me, not you. Okay? These are my stories. And if you get offended, it's because you're stupid. Also, we already have your money, so... <laughs> So buckle up. <laughs> like, it's, it's crazy. It's, it's, a, it's a weird time. I, you got to learn to laugh at things. I like, it's just like, to me, racism is so stupid. I mean, like, I was hanging out at the gym, you know, just leaving the gym, and I came back to my car, and some aggressive dude who had a Confederate flag out, he looks at me, and he goes, hey, go back to your country. And I did my ancestry, because I'm a smart gentleman. I'm like, which one? And he goes, Africa. I was like, well, sir, just so you know, Africa is a, is a continent, not a country. <laughs> His stupid reply was, well, it's a good thing that you know your history. I was like, uh, actually, that would be geography. <laughs> this is how I fight racism with pure logic. <laughs> Subscribe to Dry Bar Comedy for even more of the world's largest collection of clean comedy.